still Max Delight the leader. Max Delight is gripping on. Here's the post. Max Delight wins the derby. Max Delight over a photo between Lock and Bar Art, Malcolm's Rhythm. Max Delight and uh, Malcolm's Rhythm. Um, you know, nice horses and they've gone really well through the series. Really happy where, where, where they've gone. And um, hopefully, um, you know, we have a bit of luck so don't know. Yeah, Malcolm's Rhythm drew three, but the emergency, if he if he comes out, he'll get into two. And uh, Max Delight's drawn directly behind him, two off the back line. So we're both in the running line. Um, so they should get a good trip from there. Josh, my son's driving Malcolm's Rhythm. Chris Alford's driving uh, Max Delight. Max Delight shot through, grabbed the lead. Max Delight wins it. Max Delight has won it from a photo between King of Swing and Triple Eight. Chris won the Vic Cup on um, on uh, uh, Max Delight, and Josh has driven. Um, we've had, we've had both horses since they were young horses, so you know we've had them a while. We you know Josh has uh, we 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 have we've had Malcolm Swim since a yearling, so um, he knows them really well. Actually, both these horses quintiled the Derby here over 2,400 as three-year-olds. So as three-year-olds, the distance didn't seem to worry them. Um, They've both raced in country cups in Victoria that race, you know, between 25 and 2700 metres. But, you know, different pressure in Dominion. Um, you know, they've they got, they got, they got to be tough to sort of actually get through those the three runs and, and be strong at the end of the 3000 metre race. So, probably won't know till Saturday night, but I'm confident they'll, they'll, they'll get the journey. Lenny the Shark takes the lead from Lover's Delight. There's no catching this. Shark, Lenny's the Shark, has race home to win the Inter Dominion. You know, I've had a few runners in finals, I didn't realise the horse you've got to have to win it. Um, and I think Luke, Luke's got those sort of horses. You know, we, we, I've got really nice horses, our horses, but they they just got that they just got that extra, you know, King of Swing the other night, he was never going to win to the last little bit, and that's what great horses do. And, and Lenny was one of those, you know, he... Uh, uh, you know, you could use him three times in a race and all that sort of stuff where Max Delight and Malcolm's Rhythm probably can't make their own luck. But if they get the right run, you know, uh, they've, they've proved all the way through their career they can be dangerous. Susie Vigo's been, you know, unbelievable this, and uh, King of Swing's just a champion. So, um, you know, obviously they're, they're the, they're, you know, they're, they're, they're a great horses. So, uh, you know, you've got to have a lot of luck to beat them, but it's a horse race and sometimes the good horses don't get the don't get the good luck and uh, as I said you know my horses I'm really happy with the way they've come through they they're, uh, they were they were really fresh today they were a little tight after Bathurst but um, they were a lot better after uh, Newcastle I said when I won the Glenny it was sort of I can die a happy man because it's been my ambition it's nearly everyone's uh, trainer's ambition to win one you know it's it's the race people want to win that and the Miracle Mile I think you know we've got our big cup at home Hunter Cup but I think well, Australasia, you know, um, Ant was talking about last night at Barrier Draw how much it means to, you know, to, to everyone really. So, uh, you know, it's, uh, you know, don't care if, it was, if it's worth half the money, you know, it's just something on the resume that's pretty special.